Surprise, surprise, whether you wear glasses or not, having a screen one inch from your face is not great for your eyes. But is there something you could do? Well, maybe. Let's check it out. Hey you, Andy here. It's really nice to see you. Thank you for clicking on this video. Today, we're gonna have a look at a pair of lens attachments that have multiple potential benefits, whether you wear glasses daily or not. If you do wear glasses, you know that even with the included spacer that Oculus provides with the Quest 2, it's still not that comfortable to wear them in your headset. So being able to just snap these on and be good to go is already great. But it's not actually the thing that got me most excited about them. Now, I personally don't wear glasses, but my eyes do get tired from spending hours and hours in VR. So when a company called VR Wave reached out to me to send me a pair to test out, it got me pretty curious to see if having them on my Quest you would make any difference, so let me tell you about my experience. Most of us, myself included, spend a lot of time in front of screens every day. And with VR, it's even worse since the headset is so close to our face and being exposed to that blue light can lead to lower quality of sleep, headaches, and general eye strain, and a lot more that I'm not quite qualified enough to what talk about. What would you do without me? Hey guys, Smart Andy here. Allow me to elaborate. According to WebMD.com, even as little as two hours of exposure to blue light at night can slow or completely stop the release of melatonin, the sleep hormone. Experts believe that digital eye strain from screens affects about 50% of computer users, with symptoms that include dry eyes and blurred vision. Okay, thank you for that surprisingly interesting piece of information, but who the hell are you? I'm Smart Andy, I'm the only intelligent part of your personality. I generally kind of let you ramble on with your stupidity, but this is an important topic, and our audience needs to get accurate information. Okay, can I get back to the video now? And also our audience, I actually did all of the work. <laughs> yeah, like you could have done this without me. Okay, I don't know what the hell that was. Anyway, these lens attachments can be bought without the actual prescription, if you don't wear glasses. Mine are actually prescription free, but they do have a blue light blocking and glare reducing coating. That should help with reducing overall eye strain. Oh, let me show you something cool actually, come on. The lenses came with this little blue light and a car that has this white rectangle here that gets darker when irradiated with blue light. So let's see if these actually block blue light or not. I'm going to start here and move all the way along to see if the right half gets darker than the left one. Oh wow, okay, this method might not be the most accurate probably, but at a first glance it seems they do block blue light. Now I've also tested playing with and without them, and while I can't 100% tell you if it was placebo or not, I did sleep better and felt way more rested in the morning after playing with these on. Again, your mileage may differ, but the price without the prescription is actually pretty decent. So if you're experiencing any eye strain after using your VR headset, then something like this might be the right option for you and worth giving a try. When it comes to installation, it's pretty much as simple as it gets. Just take off your facial interface, clean the lenses with the included cleaning wipes, then slide the rings on and you'll see it kind of clicks in place. Then when you want to play, these just snap on with magnets like this. Nice and easy, I just love magnets. Just listen to that. Damn, that's satisfying. The great thing about that is that since they're so easy to put on and take off, if you get the prescription ones and share the quest with someone else in your house, it's super quick to put them on and take them off depending on who's playing. I'm going to continue using these to see if I keep seeing the benefits, and if you want to check them out, there's a link to them in the description, feel free to have a look. I hope this video was useful and at least a bit entertaining too, so let me know in the comments what you thought of it. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon, cheers! Salutations, this idiot always forgets to mention the importance of liking the video and subscribing. It helps us with the YouTube algorithm and hopefully one day allows us to do this full time for you. Have a prosperous day!